So that's too small a boat. I was thinking, you know, Kenny's boat, when Kenny was talking about his boat, I was thinking something you go out to see for months. Um, How's Omid doing? Yeah. <laughs> Omid's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound. He's got a real infection. Running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Yeah. Well? You want the good news or the bad news? Bad news. Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Uh, what about Crawford? What about Crawford? Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. <clears throat> now, hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly uh, friendly to outsiders. Yeah, we sneak in. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the Yeah. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. Bam. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's... Actually, not the worst idea I've ever heard. I it's mean, an idea I you would have came up. I don't know. She would have came up with an idea like I've that. thought about it before, what? just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So... It's decided uh, then. We're going to Crawford. Let's do this. Yeah, let's do it. We can do this. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. Yep. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? We should go tonight. Under cover of dark, I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. I told you to stay in your boat. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. Of course. Yes, it'll be dangerous. You, yeah, it's gonna be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. Uh, neither do I. Neither do I, Clint. Sometimes we have to take that. I don't think she likes that. Uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, oh, right? Oh, my heart. Ouch. Oh. <sighs> uh, what? Oh, my God. I'm going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. They didn't even give an option. 
Can't I come with you? Oh, fuck, I'll just let her come. If they give the option for it, yes. Yes. Okay, you can come. But you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm gonna go get ready. I'm afraid that we made a mistake. I hope we didn't, but... Oh, I know, but the... My heart. Yeah, she's she's helped us quite a bit of times too. There's been quite a few areas where if she wasn't there, we wouldn't have made it in, including that house. Yeah. So we have to. Yeah. I just hope she never gets bitten. I'll take us dying over her dying. You know what I mean? Yeah. As long as she doesn't die, I don't really don't want Kenny to die either. I don't either. Check out Those what I found the in the garage. If we die, that's okay. Some other tools come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. A boat that size ain't gonna hold more than five people, even with one of them a kid. Me, you, Coral, Crystal, Bernie, Billy, Mark. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, it's still one too many. Even if we cut Molly loose, before this is over, I'm gonna have to make a decision. Oh, I already know. I'm not serious. Ben. Look, I'm just saying Leave him behind. We want the best chance of... Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Well, she got a purple face. The uh, the, the more the better. We're gonna need all the help we can get. I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Just came in through the gate all fucking loud and shit. Yeah. Hold up just a sec. You ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? Uh, this isn't up for debate. Her in there and they find her? This isn't up for debate, Vernon. Decisions made. For what it's worth, I don't think it's a great idea either. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard oh. the man. Let's move out. I feel like we're making a huge mistake. Everyone's warning us. But Clem could seriously help, and she wants to. And If we leave her behind, she's just going to do the same thing and wander off alone. I think she's safer with us. And you never know, Omid or whatever, he could die. Yeah. And turn into a fucking zombie, and then she's dead for sure. I'd rather be able to have a chance to protect her than leave her alone. Beneath the center of Crawford, the old school should be directly above us. Okay, people, this is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet. Looked like she was gonna stick that in the back of his head. Stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? Let's go, team. Stay close. It goes double for you. Yeah, this is gonna be That's no fucking. What the fuck? Yeah, that is no. That's a zombie. That's not good. No. What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? Oh, fuck. Get inside! Fast! 
Fuck, fuck, fuck. Hopefully there's none in there. <laughs> 